Albine, and I'll be pers uh, playing Miss Lynn. Fernando Vasquez, I'll play Crogstead. And this is from A Doll's House. message for me at home. So what was this about? I must talk to you. Must you talk to me in this house? It's impossible where I'm staying. There's no private entrance to my room. Come in. We're quite alone. The Helmer are upstairs at the ball. I'll refer to her as soon. So the Helmers are out dancing this evening, are they? Why wouldn't they be? Why indeed? Dad, it's time for us to have a talk. Do you need anything to talk about? A great deal. I wouldn't have thought so. No, that's because you never really understood me. What was it to understand about? It's the oldest story in the world. The scrumptious ones is meant packing. There's nothing a bit more profitable comes along. Do you really think I'm that unscrupulous? Do you think I broke it off just like that? Didn't you? Is that what you really think? If it isn't true, why did you write that letter? I had no choice. I had to break with you. I thought it was only right to try to destroy your feelings for me. So that was it. So all that just, just for money? You must remember that I had a helpless mother two young brothers to take care of. We couldn't wait for you. Your prospects did seem rather shaky at the time. That as it may be, you still had no right to reject me for someone else. I don't know. I've often wondered whether or not I had the right. as if all the firm ground crumbled beneath my feet. Look at me now. I'm like a shipwrecked man. Perhaps you'll be rescued soon. I was about to be until you came along and prevented it. Quite involuntarily. I only found out today that it was you I was protecting the bank. I believe you. But now you do know. You're not going to do anything about it, are you? No! Even if I did, it wouldn't be of any help to you. Help? Help? I would have done it anyway. Well, I've learned to be sensible. The hard and bitter necessities of life have taught me that. And life has taught me not to trust high-minded platitudes. Well, then you've learned something very sensible. But you still trust actions, don't you? What do you mean? You said you felt like a shipwrecked man. I had good reason well, to. Well, I feel like a shipwrecked woman. Nothing to look back on and no one to look after. It was your decision. It was the only decision I could make. Well, what about it? If two shipwrecked people join hands, don't you think they stand a better chance of being rescued? Christine. Why do you think you came to town? You could not have been talking about me. I have to work or I find life unbearable. All my life, as far back as I can remember, I've worked and it's been the only real happiness I've had. But now, I'm all alone in the world. It's terrible. I feel so lost and hollow. There's no happiness left in working for yourself. Give me something and someone to work for, Krogstad. Help of you. Just some romantic female instinct and noble self sacrifice. Have you ever known me to be romantic? You can't really mean it. Tell me, do you know about my past? Yes. And my reputation? I thought you said with me you would have been a different person. I'm sure I would well, have been. Well, isn't there still time? Christine, you've thought carefully about this, haven't you? 
is do you have it? Have you really got the courage? I need someone to look after. And your children need a mother. You and I need each other. I still have faith in you, Clark Sapp. I'd risk anything for you. Thank you, Christine. Thank you. Now the only fun way to redeem myself in people's eyes. That's for God. It's the Tarantella. You must go. Why? What do you mean? Can you hear the music up there? When it's finished, they'll be coming down. All right. I'll go. It's all over anyway. You don't know what I've done to the Helmers, do you? I do know, yes. You still have the courage? I know how far a man like you can be driven by despair. Only after them do it. You can. Your letter's still in the letter box. You sure? Quite sure, but... Is that what all this means? Rescuing your friend at any price? You might as well tell me. Is that it? The woman who has sold herself once for the sake of others. 